Hey everybody and welcome back to Let's Play Banjo Kazooie. I'm Dan's Plays and when we came back, we just finished doing this pyramid, collecting all 100 notes and getting the last jiggy. And the sarcophagus just randomly closed on me. Now then, the pyramid has shut for eternity. All right. Now, um there's a few things I want to do here before I go and they involve a cactus and a camel. So, let's go. So, yeah, starting off, we'll do the cactus bit. Here we go. All right, so a honeycomb piece just appeared in a cactus. And the only way I really seem like I'm going to get that honeycomb piece is to fly. So I have to go to the Sphinx and fly to the honeycomb piece. Anyway, so let's go do that now. Come on, Kazooie. Don't be like this. He's not really being like anything, he's just not moving fast as I want him to. Okay, so now we have to go find the cactus. Now that we are flying. Pretty sure it's over here somewhere. There it is. It's a weird looking cactus. That's all I gotta say. Alright, 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 alright. Alright, alright, alright. Fire! Got it. Ow! A jerk. Holy crap, man. What is with all these enemies and trying to kill me? Alright, and now I'm just gonna go see what Gobi's doing. So I have to go all the way back to the Sphinx to get to the magic carpet that brings me over to him. Oh, the Sphinx. Used for many things in this level. See that little area that w only had notes earlier? Well, now there's Gobi is over there, and we're gonna go see what he wants. I gotta wait for the magic carpet. Wherever it is. I don't see it. Oh, oh shit, there it is. Ah, whatever, I'll just fly there. It'd be easier anyway. Fly, Banjo, fly! Alright. Flying. What do you want, Gobi? You still need something? I'm just gonna hit you, just because I don't like you. Oh! Bah, that's it, I'm leaving this desert to find some peace and quiet. Oh, so you can just, like, walk down mountains now? And that completes another circle of honeycomb pieces, giving me another piece of health, everybody. Which is awesome. I love having health. It rocks. Alright, and that completes Gobi's Desert. We got everything. All the notes, all the jiggies, and all the honeycomb pieces. Which makes me feel special. So, let's leave. Dun 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 dun. Alright. Wow, your best note score for this world is now 100, and it's Brentilda! Grunty's best friend at which school was the awful Saggy Maggie. When relaxing, she usually reads Big Butts and Guts magazine. These are hilarious. While sipping a glass of her favorite smoothie, Elephant Sweat. Oh, disgusting. That one was just awful. In bad taste, really. Oh, uh, these boots are gonna run out. Go. Oh. Okay, we made it. No need to go get the witch switch jiggy, which was this sarcophagus jiggy. Which I think I'm gonna need to use this thing again for. Ah, oh, crap. As <laughs> if I missed that. Okay. More mummies. Which I didn't think I saw before on the way here. Ah! Ah! Damn it. You know, I'm just gonna try and, like, back. No, I really need to do that. Okay. Well, this is wasting up all my time. Whee! Time for the super awesome jiggy dance. Another jiggy for me. 
brings us to six Jiggies in the Outer World, which brings us to 33 Jiggies in total. Which is awesome. Now, if I'm correct, then I'm gonna go check out this door up here. Because all that's in Grunty's mouth at the moment is just, um, a level that's closed. So let's go look around. This is the place that I didn't want to look at at first. So I'm gonna go inside this pipe and look around some. Yeah. Alright. Okay. Oh, it's a mumbo token, and I'm gonna be the jerk and go and get it. Because we always need mumbo tokens. I mean, we gotta be collecting them for something later. I mean, there's gotta be something. This huge ass piranha looking at me right now. That thing is going to swallow me whole. Like, I'm a bear, for Christ's sake, and that thing is a piranha. I think it'll eat me whole. Big fish! In a little pond. Now then... Let's look around at this red pipe. Anything interesting at the top? What's- uh, another huge ass piranha. What am I gonna do with you huge ass piranha? Can't you get here any faster? Come and find me, you stupid bastard. I just got bit by the fish. And I'm gonna try and climb this using my expert skills. Oh, it's a level. Oh, it's probably the level that we need. That took 10 jiggies. And it is the level, too. It's... Mad Monster Mansion. Ooh, that sounds interesting. Now, is there anything else I really need to get? Oh, it's a mumbo token. I need to get that mumbo token before I go anywhere, so... Can't stop me now, bitch. Gotta get that mumbo token before I go anywhere. Because now I know what's there. It's just gonna haunt me forever. If we find a skull in the next level, and then there's nothing I can do about it. Because... I don't know, like, I'll probably need, like, 20 or 25 or some odd mumbo tokens, and I won't have enough. And that'll just make me sad. So I'm gonna get it. Alright, we're good. We can go now. I'm gonna stop. I'm, st I'm done whining about the mumbo tokens. Now, where was the way out? <laughs> exactly. Like... Oh, there it is. I'm blind. I couldn't see it. So let's go. Go check out this new level if we get there in enough time, man. I don't know. You never know. Just the magic of YouTube with their silly 10 minute time limit. Um, 10 minute time limits suck. But whatever. Like, they're okay, but I wish, like, even sometimes I could just, like, expand a little bit. Because I wouldn't, definitely wouldn't do an entire Let's Play in one video, because that would just be ridiculous and boring, and... Yeah, so... Now we're back out here. And now that level's open, so I'm gonna go quickly run towards it. Oh, wait, before we do that, I completely forgot about over here. We have the shoes now, so we can do a bunch of crap over here and get that jiggy. Jeez, I can't believe I almost forgot about that, too. I, hopefully, all I needed was the shoes. I mean, I, we got all the moves in the game, so, like, it shouldn't be that difficult to figure out what to do, but you know me, kinda. It's a little difficult to figure out exactly what I need to do. Ah, oh, crap. Hit the thing. Flight pad appears. Grab the shoes. Now book it! Go, Banjo, go! Quick, before it disappears. Ah! Yeah! We can fly! We can fly! We can fly! Alright. 
Now, before I do anything, I need to grab this jiggy. Yeah, that's right, this is jiggy. It's time for the super awesome jiggy dance. The super jiggy dance. Alright, now we'll fly again. And kill the snowman that keeps throwing crap at us. I haven't killed a snowman in a while. Oh, you just got owned. Alright, guys. Well, that concludes this part of Let's Play Banjo-Kazooie. I'm Dan's Plays, and next time we explore that new level, I'm out. See you later.